Hey friends, uh, this is Igor with Synergy Fit. We just uh, survived a huge uh, snow blizzard in Minnesota. So I'm really happy to see you all on our YouTube channel. And uh, today I'm gonna show you uh, another unique uh, truck uh, that we just completed and that uh, we're supposed to give uh, uh, back to our customer uh, within a few days. Some of you know, Ford Transit has been uh, our most popular uh, truck model for the last uh, few years. Uh, but due to, due to supply chain issues, uh, we now see uh, Ford Transit not that often. And uh, this truck has been provided to us by, uh, by a dealer out of uh, South Carolina. So yeah, that truck uh, came to us already uh, sold to a customer. So basically, because Ford Transit nowadays uh, is uh, kind of a rare thing to see. Uh, that's uh, why I'm extremely happy to show you that uh, unique truck. And the uh, difference between uh, this Ford Transit and the uh, majority of the trucks that we completed, that we complete, is that uh, this truck comes with a low roof, custom-made box. So basically, uh, here you can uh, you can see the best. Uh, um, uh, the best way for uh, to achieve uh, perfect aerodynamics. So I guess from this position uh, you'll be able to see is that the sleeper and uh, the box on that on that truck is uh, pretty much the same level. So that's uh, what we call the best aerodynamics. And uh, the height through the uh, through the doors in that uh, box is about 84 inches. Uh, so comparing to our uh, our standard boxes that are 90 and 95 inches so this box is a bit smaller but uh, we've heard uh, from some of our customers that uh, it doesn't always uh, matter how high you are but yeah the most important is uh, drivability of your truck uh, as far as comfort and of course uh, the width of the box which uh, stays standard uh, which is 97 and a half inches uh, in between each tracks. So let me uh, let me show you some of the details uh, of that of that truck. Usually, uh, when customers order uh, extended cab sleeper, we uh, uh, we suggest them to uh, to add some extra options such as uh, extra spoiler and uh, extra side wings. But in this particular case, because a customer decided to go with a uh, with a lower box. Uh, there was no need to add the extra uh, spoiler uh, over here, but uh, he still decided to add the extra side wings. And you can see that the difference between uh, edges of the box and the side wings is about one inch. That's, all, that's it. And uh, those are a uh, really good uh, uh, benefit for aerodynamics uh, because the airflow will just... Uh, go across across the box okay now we can uh, we can talk about some other options that we uh, installed on that truck uh, the first uh, the first uh, thing that uh, I want to show you is uh, 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 manual landing gear uh, that uh, some of our customers uh, prefer to have in order to reach uh, dock level so with those legs you can actually raise uh, the uh, uh, rear end of your truck uh, up to a dock level, which is between 48 and 52 uh, inches. So in some cases, this is a really profitable uh, uh, option. Uh, so that help uh, our customers to make uh, to make money. Another uh, thing that you cannot probably see on that video, but uh, we will insert uh, it over here. This truck is also equipped with uh, um, air ride suspension system. 
Air ride suspension is uh, well known for transport for transporting um, fragile uh, goods, but it also helps to uh, to save your transmission because there is less pressure on it while you're driving, and uh, this is another benefit of installing uh, something like that. I also wanted to show you some of the uh, standard uh, details of our of all of our boxes. So below the truck you can see uh, uh, wheel covers with uh, mud flaps, which is a standard. Here is the uh, door stoppers, uh, which is also a standard. And of course, uh, some of the uh, uh, parking lights that we use on all, all of our trucks. As always, we do not uh, use uh, roll-up doors. We only install swing doors and the benefits of roll-up doors is uh, they are much lighter because they are also made of, uh, of a sandwich panel. And the other benefit is uh, they do not uh, steal extra height through the door portal. So basically, uh, all uh, roll-up doors have a lower uh, clearance through the, uh, through the doors. And here we just uh, use the maximum of available space. So here is uh, 84 and a half inches uh, uh, between the uh, uh, lower and upper um, uh, part of the uh, uh, of the frame. If you are a returning uh, uh, subscriber, uh, there is probably nothing new uh, uh, right now, but if you are watching us first time, I will uh, say a few words about the uh, inside of the box. So you can see that we have uh, two rows of e-trucks. Uh, one row is installed about 18 inches from the, uh, from the floor, the other one is about 54 inches. So basically this allows you to, uh, uh, to secure any type of freight, whether it's uh, just a, a small low uh, crate or really tall pallets, or if they double stacked, so you'll be able to uh, to securely uh, fasten them. Uh, another th uh, thing is uh, uh, we always uh, use uh, the best uh, quality products, and here is three quarters of an inch uh, thick uh, uh, specialty uh, treated plywood, which is called. Uh, um, Bakelite plywood. This is non-stick uh, non uh, floor, so uh, it's the best uh, floor that you can uh, dream for um, in your truck. Another few words about that side of a truck. Uh, the whole box is completely insulated. All of the walls, all of the, uh, all of the connections over here, over there, over here. Everything is insulated. This is a completely waterproof box. Uh, another thing is we have an extra option installed here, which is a cargo light. Unfortunately, that's not a standard. Not everyone needs it. Uh, as we know, the other thing is that the standard is uh, dog bumpers. Uh, basically, they protect, they just protect your uh, locks from being damaged by a forklift. So they will not help you uh, when you're loading uh, from the dock but they will prevent you um, uh, from damages by the forklift when you're loading from the ground. And uh, below, the, tr below the, um, the floor level, there, is, there are two uh, standard uh, tail lamps and there is a place uh, where our customer will put a, a license plate. Yeah, that's basically it. A few more words about uh, extra, extra option, but uh, here is the thing. Uh, we got that truck, uh, surprisingly, uh, completely without uh, side mirrors. We never seen it before, but yeah, for some reason Ford produced a truck uh, without mirrors, and we were supposed to uh, we were supposed to install uh, mirror extensions. And uh, when we saw the truck, we were like, uh, we don't know what to do with that. So we, we told the customer and the customer ordered uh, side uh, uh, mirrors, uh, which we here installed. But unfortunately, uh, they purchased uh, not a, a long arm mirrors, but the short arm mirrors. And uh, basically, uh, this is the wrong type of mirrors uh, that were supposed to be here. Um, but 
because of our uh, mirror extensions, uh, uh, driver would still be able to observe uh, his left and right shoulders. So yeah, this is a, a custom uh, a mirror extensions that we produce. Uh, they currently cost about $600 to install. It includes labor and parts. And this is made of, uh, made of uh, fiberglass. Uh, and basically that's produced by a 3D printer. So really cool feature if you uh, drive a Ford Transit and uh, you want to improve your, uh, um, uh, your view on the left and right side, uh, in your mirrors, uh, please give us a call and we uh, will, would be happy to uh, sell those to you. All right, a few words uh, about the uh, extended cap slipper. This is uh, our most popular uh, slipper product, um, but uh, it's only available for a few truck models such as Ford Transit, Ram Promaster uh, and the Mercedes Sprinter, so just three models. So this is a completely insulated product. It's made of fiberglass. That's why it's uh, so uh, so light. Um, and uh, but it has a lot of space. And uh, we we also offer um, an upgrade uh, to have a wider bed with a thick uh, memory foam mattress. So over here is uh, is an upgraded bed. So it's enough space for an average uh, an average person um, to sleep comfortably. Um, the uh, width over here is uh, about 28 inches, and the uh, length of the sleeper is about uh, 80, 82, 83 inches. So pretty much, if you are even a six feet tall uh, uh, person, so you will still uh, be able to comfortably uh, sleep here. Um, that sleeper um, also comes with a foldable uh, uh, table and a lot of storage, of course, and a lot of uh, different uh, power outlets, of course, 12, only 12 volts. Um, so we have uh, some of the outlets underneath the bed, some of the outlets uh, uh, on the main uh, panel over here, and uh, of course, some of the um, outlets uh, on, the, on the other side of the sleeper. Um, what else to tell you about the uh, uh, above the roof? Uh, there is a lot of storage over here, and there are more storage spaces on left and right side of the sleeper. So uh, usually uh, people store uh, their mattresses uh, up top when they do not need it. You can uh, take it off, put it away, and you'll be able to sit uh, like on the bench uh, on the left or right side. Of the sleeper and either read you some newspapers or uh, work on your laptop uh, whatever you want uh, so yeah and there is uh, there is some more storage space underneath as a bed uh, on the left and right side so all of those uh, parts are uh, foldable and uh, and removable yeah something like that and the last uh, thing to mention uh, as, as a standard option, we uh, always include the sunroof in all of our sleepers uh, unless a customer wants us uh, to install a AC air conditioner. So yes, by the way, we now offer installation of sleepers uh, with uh, air conditioners uh, that work uh, from off, off your batteries. So they do not require uh, installation of additional uh, generators but uh, in some cases they, uh, they require installation of additional uh, uh, batteries and uh, some of the switches, uh, something like that. But yeah, we, we now offer that, uh, that solution and uh, if you combine it with uh, uh, parking heaters, you are completely, uh, completely good in the winter and in the summer, so you will not have any, any problems uh, uh, idling the truck, no need to idle the truck and uh, you'll definitely uh, save a lot of money on hotels and on uh, fuel. If you have any uh, questions or comments about our sleepers, uh, feel free to leave them uh, below and uh, or simply uh, reach out to us uh, by phone or email during our regular business hours. Congratulations, so you, uh, you watched to the end. Uh, basically, I showed you uh, everything that we did uh, uh, net truck and right now I'm just uh, gonna summarize uh, all of the uh, all of the options that we installed here. So that was a 2023 Ford Transit 
350 HD 178 wheelbase. Uh, that was a cutaway, uh, cutaway chassis. So we we had to install a lower part of the cab back wall in order to install uh, extended cab sleeper. That truck uh, also comes with extended cab sleeper with uh, uh, with uh, extra side wings with uh, frame extensions, uh, custom 14 feet uh, box, uh, manual landing gear, air ride suspension, uh, cargo light, and I think that's it. So pretty, uh, pretty well equipped truck. And uh, the whole construction weighs only uh, 1,700 pounds altogether, like all, all of the parts that we installed. Yeah, and by, by the way, I forgot to, uh, to mention the side mirror extensions that we installed. So the, uh, the box itself weighs only 1,250 pounds, sleeper adds uh, about 350 pounds, and I added about 100 pounds uh, for uh, all other extra accessories such as side wings, uh, um, such as uh, mirror extensions, uh, uh, cargo light, and etc. So uh, again, we do not uh, sell those trucks. Uh, we get chassis directly from dealers or from customers. So if you if you are a customer and you do not have a dealer, uh, please uh, feel free to contact us, and we uh, would be happy to uh, share information of our preferred dealerships. Uh, we have dealers. Uh, who speak English, we have dealers who speak Spanish, we have dealers who speak uh, Russian, Ukrainian and all, all kind of languages. So don't hesitate to contact us. Elsa, thank you so much uh, for, be, uh, for being uh, our subscribers. If you haven't subscribed yet, because this is your chance, uh, uh, please also like this video and share with your friends. Uh, we highly appreciate it. And we also like when you uh, when you leave us comments. So please, when you are done watching the, this video, leave your comment below. Thank you so much. And one one more time, my name is Igor. Uh, I'm with Synergy Fit. We are a box truck manufacturing company, and we'll see you soon. Thank you.